After 20 miles of biking, we're finally here. We're at Pirai. Um, that's the river right down there. And there's some old buildings over here. You can see there's this foundation here of an old building right over there. And then there's some more that direction. Um, so we're gonna do some detecting today and we bite 20 miles. So hopefully we find something worth it. We got the first target of the day. And it's a good one, it's a one batute. Look at this guys. I just pulled this out. It has these dots on the side. It might be a folded coin or a very old coin. Okay, I just ran to get you. So I think I found something cool. Um, I was just searching up out down the path because I saw this rocks here. Might be a culvert going to the river down there, but I'm not sure. So I just come down the path and all this from old buildings and I got a good signal right down in here. Where did it go? There it is. I dug a little bit and look at that. It's a coin. I don't know what it says. Six pence. It says six pence. Man, it's cool. I have found a three pence. Um, a three pence. I haven't, I didn't record that one day that I found that. That was quite cool. That was in the village. Look at this. Oh! Six pence. That's awesome. Yeah. It's right in that crack there. That rock stone is there. 1904? <laughs> what? That might be silver. We gotta get going now. Okay, I'll just check this one area right here. 1904. Okay, so I'm heading back to the car, um, bikes. I didn't find anything else right that spot. There's some other targets there, but I think they didn't seem to appear the same as that one. So we're gonna have to come back here again. Hopefully quite soon. Um, rain season coming, so the ground is softening up. And so yeah. But then, we're gonna go back. Yeah, so let's take a look at the start with this. I think this is some lead. And then we'll take this shell casing. It's a shell casing with R on it. Somewhere there. And the fish hook. This thing, I'm not sure what it is. If you have a, have a suggestion about what this is, you could comment below. But other than that, I can't figure it out. It's like it snapped off there. That side there. This side's normal. I don't know. If you have an idea about that, comment below and I'll check check it out, see if it's right. Next, we can go to one batute. They call it my other one batute. It's eggs and one batute. And this one says it's 1974. It's right at the top there. I'm not sure if you can see it. 1974. I don't think I've got a coin in 1974 before. It's quite cool. And then we've got the sixpence. Um, it's not British West Africa, but it's 1904. I don't know, what is it? This 1974, I said that right? And this is 1904, this six pence. So it's most likely a solid silver. It's quite cool, I'm gonna look that up and make sure it is solid silver. It says Edward the Seventh on it. Yeah, it's quite cool. If you wanna know what it exactly it says on it, it's at the bottom of the video right now. But, and then the last, we got this thing, this white speck it looks like in the camera. You think, well, what's that? Yeah, I know. Um, it could be a very old coin, but I have found some letters on it. It says C H A U X. I can read that right inside there. Um, 
I can't find out anything else on the front or the side that isn't folded. There's a star and it says T A. It might be R M. I don't know what else. Um, but yeah, those are the finds for today. It's quite cool. Um, we went out to Pirai, and I think we're gonna be back there again. My legs are aching from the <laughs> bike ride. Um, I think we did about 39 miles biking today, and so my legs are aching a little bit because I haven't done that long for a while. Yep. Thanks for watching today and hope to see you soon.